know, the autonomous vehicles are all the rage these days. Like, just like in the movies, those self-driving cars. How cool is that? So, today I've learned about the autonomous vehicle technology at Hyundai Mobis. They are building their own self-driving car systems. That's so cool! You may think, what does a kid who doesn't even have a license know about cars? Well, I know much more than you think I do. And it's not that hard, maybe. There are many technologies for autonomous driving. These days, most of them are based around ADAS, Advanced Driver Assistance System, or also known as ADIS. There's a lot of technology involved in ADIS, so today I'm going to just explain just a few of them. The first one I'm going to explain is LDW. Lane Departure Warning. So when you're driving, you might see a sports car next to you, or a unicorn driving a car, or your mind might start wandering. And when that happens, you start to drift into another lane. So what LDW does is send you a warning, like beep, 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 so that you can get back on track. The second one is LKA. Lane Keeping Assist is very similar like LDW, but the difference is LDW gives you a warning, then LKA actually literally steers the handle for you to get you back on track. So like when you're driving a little crazy and you're like, ah, then the LKA will steer the wheel and get you back on that lane. But don't worry, it won't control you like Skynet. Are you with me? The third one is the core of the ADAS. It's called FCA, Forward Collision Avoidance Assist. So basically what it does is if a child starts running into the road, then the car will stop or it will steer into the other direction. Let's say if another car from the opposite side comes towards you, you're like in panic mode. But FCA to the wow. rescue. FCA is very calm and will save your life by stopping or steering the wheel to the other way. The fourth one is SCC. Smart Cruise Control. It's just like the name. So your car is so smart that if you just put in a speed, then it will go into that speed. Or it could follow the navigation and follow the speed. So the SCC helps you maintain a safe distance between the cars. It also, you don't need to step on the gas pedal or the brake, but you have to keep your eyes on the road. Are you with me? So the next technology I'm going to explain is BCW, Blind Spot Collision Warning. When you're driving, you have to look at those three rearing mirrors and there's a blind spot. It also warns you but it also assists you so that you can kind of like turn if the car is suddenly coming by the side. The final technology we're gonna learn, the final acronym I'm going to use is HDA. Basically, it's just all the technology I talked about combined together. HDA stands for Highway Driving Assist. It kind of like changes lanes for you by the navigation and it stops for you and it even warns you when there's some kind of object or an animal in front of you. Wow, we learned a lot today. We learned LDW, LKA, FCA, SCC, BCW, and HDA. All these technologies we learned they're all combined to A-D-A-S, ADIS. I hope you remembered all of that because all these technology systems helps keep us safe. I really look forward to life when there's no car accidents. I'll be back to explain more cool and interesting car technologies. Don't forget to like and subscribe. See you next time.